Then I'm going to evaluate limit x tend to 0 under root 1 plus 3x minus under root 1 minus 3x by x. So let's see the answer. So first here writing the given limit x tend to 0 here 1 plus 3x under root next is under root 1 minus 3x divide by x. So we can easily achieve the output if I remove the root first on the numerator. So 1 plus 3x minus root 1 minus 3x divide by x. So here to remove the root so this place I am going to multiply here 1 plus 3x plus 1 minus 3x divide by root 1 plus 3x plus root under 1 minus 3x. So suppose this is here a minus b here a plus b that is a square minus b square. This is a a b b between minus and plus is there. So a square minus b square. So writing here limit x tend to 0 a square root 1 plus 3 x a square minus root 1 minus 3 x a square. After that here writing denominator part x 1 plus 3 x plus 1 minus 3 x. So root that removed by the square so writing here limit x tend to 0 so this is 1 plus 3 x and this here 1 minus 3 x divide by write the denominator part x root 1 plus 3 x plus root 1 minus 3 x after that multiply the minus limit x tend to 0 1 plus 3 x this is here minus plus 3 x and next is x 1 plus 3 x plus 1 minus 3 x. So 1 1 cancel now here limit x tend to 0 3 plus 3 that is 6 x divide by x root 1 plus 3 x plus root 1 minus 3 x. This cancel here x x and finally we get limit x tend to 0 6 divided by root 1 plus 3x plus root 1 minus 3x after that here write limit x tend to 0 so 6 here root 1 plus 3 into 0 plus 1 minus 3 into 0 so the next is here 6 so this become 1 plus 0 this become root 1 minus 0 after that here 6 1 plus 0 root 1 here 1 minus 0 root 1 6 root 1 that is 1 here root 1 1 so 1 6 plus 1 plus 1 2 it cancel by 3 times so 3 is the answer of this limit question so one time going to repeat write the given remove the t numerator remote numerator root so for this we need to multiply that terms after that that is based on a minus b a plus b use that after doing the calculation here you can get this terms and put the value now you can get 3 so 3 is the answer of this limit question so this is the way we can find the root of this limit question so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you